Hey love, so I got this adorable little box in my uh, PO box from a company called Go Cubes. It is chewable coffee. Let's open it up and see what we've got. So you gotta mention the little things. This was on top, uh, you know, to protect the package or the box or whatever. It's the box of cubes and um, I took this off already. Woo! That is a strong scent. It took my breath away when I took this off. Um, but you get 20 packs in here so they sent me this it look kind of looks like a store display kind of we got an invoice uh um well it doesn't matter if you see my address y'all because it's my PO box uh if you want to write me i love getting letters just saying 39 dollars 39 dollars What the freaking crap? Oh my gosh, I had no idea. So yeah, this is $39. What, roughly $2 a pack. If I paid for it, it would have been $39. And right now I'm already thinking, uh, yikes. <laughs> a free sticker of me, Samaya, but I have no use for this. They put their logo right over her face. A nice sentiment, I suppose. It's a good message. Yeah, a Go Cube sticker, which looks like this. This reminds me of kind of like an eyeball. <gasps> Illuminati. Not sure what I'm gonna do with that, but it is cute. It was until. But anyway, you'll also get a biohacker booklet, also for free. So why? I don't know why it's called a biohacker booklet. This um, is just explaining about their company and just advertising some of their other products, but I'm not gonna talk about those because I'm supposed to be talking about these. So that's what came in the box. Meanwhile. It's super early in the morning. I literally just got, oh, I know I might be all over the place right now. <laughs> got these a couple days ago and I was just waiting to film. I might be scared what I look like because I just woke up. There's supposed to be different flavors in here, which yeah, I don't know. But I normally drink coffee like as soon as I wake up. Like I go to the bathroom, sorry if TMI, and then I immediately go make or grab my coffee. I need to uh, go ahead and eat a couple of these. Um, two cups is one pack, or two cups per pack, so one cup. Um, I need my caffeine, ladies and gents. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Obviously, well, I'm gonna go set the drop on, and I'm gonna taste these. We'll do a first impressions. I'm gonna give you some information in text regarding things that I've already gathered. Um, well, gosh. Just by getting them and my initial thoughts about them. I will see you guys in a minute. minutes later so morning one day one trying one of these cubes I tried this one I'm not sure which flavor it is the flavors are listed on the side of the pack but um, you don't know which one is which as you can see just by the initial look of them they all look pretty much the same that's as far as I got and that was one bite you can even see my teeth marks. And I honestly, I could not finish it and I can't get the taste out of my mouth. I wanted to be able to try this on camera and to get a true initial reaction. So this is my true first reaction. I know you can't see my face. My stomach, it has like a tiny cramp to it and I don't know if this is the culprit, but I've had nothing else on my stomach yet. So that could be a factor. I haven't worked out yet either. Normally I do have coffee before I work out and that's one of the reasons I thought these would be good. So since the company did approach me for reviewing this, I do have an email where one of the people told me which flavors were which. 
so I will come back here in a second I'm gonna go check my email and tell you if I could figure out which flavor this is I may have to cut into these to see like what the colors are of them but it's three flavors we've got two of one of these flavors in here <laughs> Okay, so after going back and reading the email, I'll insert a little little clip of what I'm saying right here. Pure Drip is in between. The mocha is the darkest and the latte is the lightest. For the company to actually say they know it's hard to tell, that clearly has got to be one of their number one complaints. And just from the one I just tried, still can't even try to figure out which one of these it is so scared to even try another one this one looks pretty light to me so maybe that one is gonna be um latte this one looks kind of dark so maybe it's gonna be a mocha I was hoping that maybe like underneath the cubes it would have like what flavor they were that just dawned on me. I thought, well, maybe it says, but it doesn't. Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah. Like, I have to go make coffee now because I thought this was going to be my coffee for this morning. Ugh. I really don't want to try another one. They're going in the garbage. I've seen reviews on this. And the one common thing that people say is that they don't know which flavor is which. Imagine tons of complaints about that. Don't know how people keep a straight face when trying these. Sometimes they can't, they literally can't. And maybe sometimes, maybe they've already figured out which flavor they can stand the most. <laughs> um, for me, it's definitely not this one. The thing that sucks is that you need two of these to equal one cup of coffee. Oh crap, one of them just fell out. Oh well. Oh gosh, the smell of that. Oh my gosh, it's so strong. Each cube is 50 milligrams of caffeine. 50 plus 50 equals 100. So what sucks is you can't buy a pack of all latte if you like all the latte. You can't buy a pack of all mocha. Already you don't like that flavor. So if I have two of those in a pack, there goes my money because I'm gonna get two cups of coffee out of this pack. I'm gonna get one and a half cups and that's if by some short miracle, I actually like the other flavors, which I'm very scared because I just got a whiff of after I flipped that package over. Oh my gosh. And the taste is lingering in my mouth. I can't, oh, it's just so bad. It's so bad. I, uh, uh, I wanted to show my initial reaction of the cubes, um, you know, because it's always interesting. The, the whole concept of watching somebody try something for the first time is really, it's truly interesting. But the thing is, um, I don't think you guys would have been very um, interested in seeing me literally gag and I almost threw up and such a blur it all happened so fast I honestly don't remember how I was even able to swallow that much of it I can't oh my gosh it's just terrible I started watering and I was literally um, gagging so uh, it's not a good look <laughs> So I don't want that all over YouTube. <laughs> so that's it you guys. That's my review for the Go Cubes Chewable Coffee. I personally really dislike these in case you couldn't tell and I'm so disappointed because I was genuinely excited about trying this product when I received it in my P.O. box and um, in speaking with the company you know it seemed like it was just gonna be the best thing ever and I was so excited. This was really a letdown. Straight up coffee is way healthier for you than these would be. Um, and that's just my personal opinion, but all I know is my coffee doesn't have glucose syrup, sugar as the first ingredients, just saying. I wanted to mention that my husband barely could, he couldn't even eat as much of a cube as I did. 
I have to be fair, if you look on Amazon, you'll see reviews um, that are saying the complete opposite. I do find it very interesting, though, that on Amazon, a lot of the reviews are um, people who receive the product for free, and they were Vine reviews, and even those were negative. But there were a lot of positives, too, and a lot of uh, negatives, and this is just my personal opinion. I did not like this product at all. And I just want to be honest with you guys um, because this was supposed to be a first impressions type of video and I was genuinely excited about this product and I normally keep it positive on my channel and I also keep it real um, but normally I would have handled this behind the scenes you know and just told the company I'm sorry but I don't like these you know and offer to send them back as I always do um, but I figured that uh, I would just go ahead and put this up because I genuinely didn't know that it would turn out bad because I just thought they sounded so fantastic. So leave me a comment. Let me know what your thoughts are. Have you tried these? Do you like them? I would encourage you to go check out some reviews. I just say Amazon as an example to be able to get an unbiased opinion um you know from someone who bought the product and wasn't sent the product for free and sometimes people i'm not saying everybody does this um sometimes people do feel obligated to lean more toward positive things and they do the things that are negative and they feel nervous mentioning negative things and they may very well not have even had anything negative to say i don't want to leave it on a negative note at all wanted to be honest and let you guys know how i really felt and this was the first impressions type video that i had planned and it didn't go as planned but i'm still putting it up i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and as always thank you so much for watching and i will talk to you all soon bye